saw this cast part here. It's still cast pot metal, so it can be a pound and a half out of there, two pounds if I'm lucky. And a cord. Like, you're constantly throwing stuff out in the sky, but I him, like, wouldn't take my card, but I know he seems to be dumping stuff all the time. All that stuff looks like it's got old price tags on there. Maybe at an antique store or something where he buys junk. Some guys are addicted to buy stuff over and over. Okay, so cruise this area here. Well, this is just scrap yard, so I'm not expecting too much, but Sometimes I get lucky, you get the odd thing. It was worth a look. Okay, not get much out there. I grab a little tricycle type thing, but nothing out there. So this one I cut up, it would be smaller anyway, so I'm not too worried about this one. If I could apply some screws, bulky, bulky, bulky. Not seeing very much out there to be honest. So whatever I'm small I can take, I guess. It's real thick oil on the side here. I think this thing has, has that legs on the bottom, I think. There's a little bit of a little bit of the bottom on there. I see. It's like almost like a mouse nest in there. Hmm. I'm gonna wash it first. And then take the panels off after. Okay, let me get uh, let me sweep this mess here, and then I'm gonna get uh, water and soap and all that. Gotta keep the place clean, it's the name of the game. I think Bradley brought this here for me. GPS, German. Okay.
actually I'm gonna fill my bucket up first to clean it. Like two screws only, should be just missing two screws on the side here. As long as I clean the most grease and oil off it, it'll touch the black up. Be a flat black anyways, and I got a, like a red color. Some kind of red. to Home Depot I mean the prices are so crazy I got pine saw but that's what I got here gone all that was 85 bucks it's ridiculous Dawn is usually pretty good so the soap are all up really good Be cheap. Okay. So yeah, it's really Dawn's fighting the grease. most greasy spot it was this spot here these areas It's really greasy. Needs lots of soap. 
I mean, that might be okay, even this color here, the way it looks. Can't tell if it's grease or rust. I went to Home Depot, you know, one could buy with. Didn't have a degreaser there. And can you tire that one that was around here? They moved it's miles away and they're doing road construction, so roads are all screwed up. Gonna prove it anyways a little bit. strong enough well it's gonna keep washing I guess okay I'm gonna keep washing it okay, okay I found this uh, engine cleaner the garage yeah that work better better probably real foamy
Probably found us in some jobs somewhere probably cleaner I think. Heavy duty non-drip. It's all it's doing is dripping. Most greasy spots are on top. Okay, it's almost empty. Okay, this is a little, we'll have to wait a little bit. Okay, hold on. Okay, so I used the one spray. It almost went clear, it washed it all off. And then I sprayed a little bit on the top. That's all I had left. And then uh, this tray actually kind of came up pretty good. Not too bad. Still a little bit greasy, but uh, what do you do? I get most of it anyways. Uh, I use the rag. When it dries a little bit, maybe I'll get a little rag on it. So, We ended up drying about a half an hour maybe. It's warm out here, it's like a full sun. Basically. Yeah, I'm gonna probably stick it on the edge of that table there. All I have to do is drop one in down, pull the dolly out. But at least if I paint the black, I'm gonna paint this red. Look a little cleaner and maybe um won't rust as bad well this is solid steel this thing does it's probably about 200 pounds i think they don't uh, rust out really they're solid so i'm going to take that panel off maybe and i can i just wanted to save the coats 44 on there 40 40 a so at least someone knows what kind of machine it is I brought tape, so maybe I can just tape this right here. Tape this and paint the rest all red. Even leave this logo here. But you can get all kinds of parts on uh, eBay, but like say they're really expensive, like really, really expensive. Just 70 bucks for that, and this could be you know, 50, 60 bucks for this, and that tool, and this tool, and but. More tires I can do, like especially aluminum, I'll say five bucks because it would cost me five bucks if I take it off at a tire shop. So everything I can take off myself, I'll save money and then all the H uh, HMS I get, this bolt's loose, the HMS I get out of it, it's gonna be extra money too. It all adds up, right? Okay. Okay, so we uh separate these out here the plastic will go plastic okay I'm here These are all going to be the same. Pop cans. 
relief. Milk jugs, 10 cents. Juice boxes are separate. Seven percent seats alcohol. Okay, it's still there for now. Pop glass is separate, everything is separate. Separate, separate. And when I have all, everything sorted, I'm going to put 100 in the bag, whatever. Arizona, so it's probably pop. Sargami steam beer. These I'm sorting out here. I'm just gonna sort a few at when I get there. Just the oddballs, like the milk cartons would be separate. I won't have like bags full. We'll have lots of pop and lots of beer and water bottles. Last one. Just box. cents each don't laugh that's up you can see a bag inside the road you can leave it there no why would you Mostly plastic. So it doesn't have a lot of plastic. So that in like that. That's one plastic down. Since we're starting to get some categories. I'm not sure if these one liters are a little different category. It's plastic, but make it pay differently. Who knows? I'll leave those out for now.
fuzzy peach for me. So many different kinds, it's a problem. Okay, so we kind of got the drift on this. I got uh, two bags there and one big bag there, and then a couple here. Okay. That's a different size. dirty inside that's just grease anyways doesn't matter it's not gonna be you don't see that anyways rakes here that Fifty years garbage bin. I thought there was a nest here or something because I saw all this here.
Can I get my spray paint ready? Start painting my can. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna paint this one here. So it's just as a warning sign, I want to keep it on there. Smell the paint, huh? I need a couple coats at least. It's actually not bad. The color is almost pretty close. Almost. Still kind of warm, so it should uh, soak it pretty quick. Yeah, that's better now.
Okay, leave that one like that. Oh, we'll use some to have a can. Should have got maybe another one. Weird how it's just absorbing the paint like crazy. Wow, unbelievable. I probably need another one. I don't know, oh my god, it's. Yeah, we have a lot of paint. I don't know. We got more paint. It's a bummer. I'll have to get more paint. That's a bummer. Oh well. If I don't know, I would have got two. I thought one would easily do because I don't like to use a red too often, I don't think, you know. <clears throat> so the color should be okay. Ooh, the black goes on so nice. Well, like a million dollars. Wow. It's weird how the red took forever and it, it kind of absorbed it into the metal. Well, it's rust oleum, so it might have something to do with that. Rust protection. Almost like it. it's running out of the air. It's 
So we kind of want to cover that sticker up, the coats. Keep it original because this is an old, pretty old piece of machinery. I'm gonna shock off this thing. Someone's singing there. That's good enough. As long as I can kind of see. We don't really someone care too much, but I'll try to keep the original coats name. Look at the church band singing. Black goes on so good. Oh. Okay, hold on. Okay, two cans going. The black. So what I want to do is um, I'm gonna go get the, some more paint to paint this here, and then it'll be done. It dries pretty fast actually. So we got Home Depot. It's gonna look pretty good. At least it's not rusty looking. And then when you're touching stuff, you're not getting rust all over your hands. That's the good part. Okay. I'm gonna head to Home Depot here. I need um, this kind here. Rustoleum. Oh, apple red, huh? Apple red, don't look like apple red. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, finally back. Just gonna paint this part red. Cause that's the danger points here.
where do I want to blotch through all the time? I don't know if it's the grease, but I cleaned it pretty good. Still holding a little bit better now. Second coat, I guess. I just want to paint this one here, but it doesn't really matter. This one is kind of where it's dangerous if you don't know what you're doing. Well, it's just sucking up paint like crazy. It's already empty. Fifteen dollars, just like that. Just like that. Well, that's all I'm gonna spend on this one. Boom. Okay. Not too bad. I got just a little hair for this thing here. Sounds empty, but no. Nope. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. And then I brought some black again here because I knew that overspray a little bit somewhere.
Someone's singing like a church or something. Yeah, it's look good, I think. Better than uh, before, so. At least it won't be greasy. It's just a black primer, nothing fancy. knob of it. I think that's pretty lit. That's the lower, the devil, devil side. I'm never painted this part, but none in the world. If I tape it, then I can paint it. A few more paint here. Okay, well, I think I'm going to clean up a bit and that's going to call it a day. Pretty productive, got a lot of stuff done. Just the same same stuff here. Primary, uh, so I got a couple cans left. Yeah, I don't think this mask is that great. Not that great, it's still dust goes through. No name N95, it's probably garbage. So I got my soapy bottle ready already. Right there is my soapy bottle for my tire. Perfect. Okay, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I just like I say, all, all the cans are stored out here. These are pop cans. That's plastic juice and pop. That's beer. Two beer. Juice boxes are separate, and these are miscellaneous. The bigger jugs and different category. Maybe I'm not sure, but There's some glass wine, some glass pop, and so on. So that will be it, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.